uh, another preview, I guess, man. Uh, so the Ravens must win game against the Bengals, and thank God I made this video late because if I did not, I would have done it without all these. All this disaster that happened on Saturday. Tyler Huntley tested positive for COVID. Not gonna, he, he's not going to play. Uh, Lamar did not travel with the team. Uh, we have more injuries. We and also the game is not even postponed either. Like they, it's supposed to play. It's supposed to be played as planned. So Josh Johnson is going to be the quarterback. For this team, uh, 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 for this game, while the Bengals have a fully healthy squad, it's just oh, man, uh, we have injuries, and then now we have COVID hitting us on on, on all four uh, on, on all, all four sides. You know, it's it, it is just. It, it is just impressive this season, man. I just want twenty twenty two to happen. With, with, you know, like, how, how is it even fair? How is it even fair that we're that injured? That much of an injured team? Like, we, we're supposed to have clinched this AFC already. A healthy Ravens team already clinches the AFC. Is first in the AFC, clinches it. It's, it, it's over. It, it, it's already over. But I guess, man, and we probably beat the Bengals both times. We sweep the Bengals, sweep the Browns, sweep the Steelers. Probably sweep the entire division, too, with how close we played the games. Uh, but, yeah, it, it's a must-win game. I, I don't know how to say. Uh, I'm still going to have optimism because anything is possible. The, the Bengals already let a, no, a QB who has no business in... And actually starting, actually beat them in week eight. So I guess, man, uh, we're gonna need a, a, a big miracle, a, a Christmas miracle, you know, a, a Christmas miracle. Uh, by the way, Merry Christmas to everybody. Hope you had a great Christmas, a, a good day. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, all I'm gonna say is on defense. We shouldn't be blitzing. We shouldn't be blitzing at all. Uh, it's, it's it's not smart. I mean, our defense, I think, still there. We're getting Chuck Clark back. You know, even with the injuries, at least it's not as bad as in the offense. Like, our, our starter and our quarterback, our MVP quarterback and our good backup is... Our, uh, they're both out. They're both out. Uh, but anyway, uh, it, man, if it was, if there was any season Lamar would get injured, it's, it's this one, it's this one. And, uh, we're going to need a lot to do this off season. Uh, but you know, it, it, it's a call for another video, but there are going to need to be big changes coming into the off season because we cannot continue like that. Especially on offense. Uh, but yeah. And, and I hope we get aggressive as well. Because next year has to be the year. Our quarterback's getting paid. We need to invest into helping our franchise quarterback. Taking care of him. Or else it's it's it's, it's done. It's, it's, it's all... It's, it's all lost at this point. You know? But yeah, man, uh, on offense, I, I hope we're able to just, you know, it, it, it just like run the ball. I, I, I think we should run the ball, uh, give it to Freeman. Uh, don't make Johnson throw a lot. The O-line's going to have to keep, it, 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 it's going to have to hold. It's going to have to hold. This O-line is horrible. Uh, but what we do with the O-line, uh what we're going to need to do is, of course, protect our quarterback. That's a no-brainer at all. But 
honestly, I would bench Alejandro Villanueva for sure. I, I, I would bench him and put in David Sharp. Okay? David Sharp should be the guy. Okay? So, David Sharp by left tackle. Left guard needs to be Ben Cleveland. Ben Cleveland needs to stay there for the rest of his career. Okay? He needs to stay there, be starting for the rest of his career, bearing injury. And... And that's a fact. Ben Cleveland is a monster. Uh, what again? On center, of course, uh, of course, Bozeman has been elite this year. Uh, Zeitler at right guard. Yeah. Uh, right tackle is going to be Mikari. That's the best O-line we can have right now. Villanueva should not be starting. Okay? He sucks. He still isn't good. Honestly, David Sharp in a limited amount of snaps has been way, way better. I'm just getting this out of the way right now. So, what we're going to need to do, we're going to have a simple game plan. Uh, just play with heart and, and, and play like a Raven, most importantly. We, we lost by one point against the Green Bay Packers, the best team in football. Uh, the Browns are pretty much eliminated, so that's out of the way. The Browns are out of the way. Uh, they're not winning out. I know that for a fact. They're not winning out. The Steelers are probably going to beat them next week. With the way Baker's playing, he's not. Uh, the, the Browns are out of the question. Steelers, out of question too. It, it's us and the Bengals. Uh, we... This game is a must-win, must-win game, and and I think we can definitely pull it off. Well, yeah, man, it, it it's not much of a preview, but I, I said what what needed to be said. What is there to preview if we have nobody? We have nobody on off. We have nobody healthy. We have nobody healthy. We have like 38 active players who are actually able to play. So that's all I'm saying. I'm saying play it simple on both sides of, uh, on both sides of the ball. Uh, don't play it aggressive. Anything like that, and, and play with heart. It's it, 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 it's what brought us close in 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 these in the past three games, and hopefully we can pull this off this time around. But yeah, man, I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoyed. Tell me you guys how you feel about this game. Honestly, I'm gonna keep the optimism, optimism, but I, I'm I'm scared for this game.